Podcasts. Hey guys, it's Ryan here with U-Haul. We're gonna go ahead and show you how to install a hitch on your Buick Rendezvous. It can take you to some really fun places such as camping, bike riding, or even towing a U-Haul trailer almost anywhere in Northern America. Let's go ahead and show you how to break this hitch down. All right guys, we're gonna point out our mounting location. We're up here on the driver's side. There's gonna be three attachment points on each side. Driver and passenger are identical. We're gonna use the hitch as a template and we're gonna drill one in the back body flange here. And then there's two up underneath on the frame rail. You're gonna take your provided carriage bolt and spacer block and pole wire. You're going to fish wire back through the front attachment point, thread the bolt on, and get your spacer block up under the frame rail. Pull it back down through, and make sure your spacer block is kind of turned a little bit so they don't overlap. Now we're gonna take another carriage bolt and spacer block and we're gonna reverse fish wire it down through the access hole again. We're gonna still make sure we don't overlap those spacer blocks. And then we're gonna repeat everything, same on the passenger side. All right, I'm here with a hitch up on a U-Haul exclusive hitch jack. If you don't have one, it's a good idea to get an extra set of hands. I'm gonna go ahead and point out the mounting locations that are identical on each side. There's gonna be two here. These are gonna be the bolts that we just fish wired up. And then this one right here is where we're gonna drill into the rear body flange. All right, let's go ahead and get this hitch into place. You can go ahead and lower the exhaust for ease of installation, but for now we haven't. Also make sure when you go ahead and put the hitch in place, you take care not to push the bolts back up into the frame rail. All right, back up over here on the driver's side. There's a wiring harness right here. We wanna make sure not to pinch up in between the hitch and the frame rail. Make sure those bolts come straight back through and then attach the provided flange nuts. Then we're gonna go ahead and do the same thing on the passenger side. Now in order to get this attachment point into place, we need to go ahead and snug up these flange nuts with a 19 millimeter socket and extension. All right, the goal of making sure we snug these flange nuts up is to go ahead and make sure that this attachment point hits the back of this body flange. I'm gonna repeat the process on the driver's side. For the last mounting location, we're gonna use a 716 drill bit, and using the hitch as a template, we're gonna drill through the rear body flange onto the other side. Then we're gonna go ahead and do the same thing on the passenger side. All right, so we're back up over here on our driver's side. We're gonna use our provided hardware, making sure the washer is on the side of the body flange, and then taking the flange nut and putting it on the back. And we'll repeat the process on the passenger side. Now that we've got all of our hardware into place, we're gonna go ahead and torque it down to the manufacturer's specifications using a 19 millimeter socket and a five inch extension on these two bolts here. And this one here is gonna require a 14 millimeter socket and 14 millimeter crescent wrench. And we're gonna repeat the same on the passenger side. Right, guys, now that we've got the hitch installed, I'm gonna give you some important measurements for your two inch receiver to make selecting a bike rack or ball mount a little bit easier. From the ground to the top of the receiver tube opening is gonna be 12 and a half inches. And from the hitch pin hole to the outside of the bumper is gonna be five inches. All right guys, that's gonna do it for the install of the hitch on the Buick Rendezvous. Whether you're towing a trailer, going camping or bike riding, be safe and have fun.